Hello, everyone. Welcome to day two of Amaze. Apologies for starting late. We are having, having some technical difficulties, uh, but everything's gonna be fine today um, with some technical hiccups, but still, um, I'm super happy to be here and have Marie with me. Uh, I'm gonna introduce her shortly. Um, but uh, yesterday we had the opening uh, for um, Amaze by Thorsten. Um, with a beautiful performance by uh, Nana Tokia. And today we kick off the first of three days of Amaze live stream with a wonderful speakers, talks, performances from people all over the world. And I'm very happy with that. So welcome to Amaze day two. And I'm hoping you enjoying this uh, stream and everything around to Amaze Festival uh, for the next coming days. Um, yeah, so um i'm here with marie and Hi. normally we would do a um we would go to the may space but we will talk about that later <laughs> <laughs> but yes i'm here with marie marie can you introduce yourself shortly yes of course very nice i'm really happy to be here so i'm marie i'm from the uh, seek house and the overkill festival in the netherlands and um we are an art and gaming space in Enschede on the east of the Netherlands. And we work with LIDA since a few years now. Um, but in our space, so we try to bring art and games and music and films, uh, everything which touches a little bit uh, fiction together to try to explore um, yeah, actual topics, social issues. And uh, so each year we pick a theme and then we look at all these uh, cool mediums and then we bring it together in a playful festival, lots of improvisation, a lot of experimentation. So that's a, that's a lot of fun. This is what uh, I do. Yes, it's, uh, it's awesome. And together we actually have a, a thing called exploration modes, mm -hmm. which we have been doing for the past, well, I guess since November last year. Yeah. And every month we go to a different space, online digital space that we explore. We look at it shortly before that we uh, going on the live stream, and then we explore the whole thing together with the, with our audience. Um, and we've been to some interesting uh, spaces, actually. Do you can you remember yes, some yes. of it? Okay. Yes, yes, of course. Well, we went. I think we started last year during uh, the Overkill Festival, but we went already so to uh, the May space of last year, and, uh, and that was the idea to see okay, what changed this time. And then we went to many spaces, some spaces from the Rodinas, uh, also for festivals. We went to, uh, what was the name? The Burning Man. That was, now I forgot the name of this one. That was, you know it, so I did find it back. I see that you're like, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. that was cool. Burning Man. <laughs> yes. <laughs> We went this year. We went. Uh, we went to beautiful spaces. The LEV uh, Mundo from this, uh, uh, yeah, LEV festival in, in Spain, and we went to Horizon. I think that was the one we, where we had the most fun. And um, from some artists you invited uh, also this year at the uh, at the festival, right? Yes, or, we also did some. Yes. We also did some uh, like like uh, things, yes, yeah. um, which is also going to be a workshop later today, uh, where you can make your own like like space or so 2D space. Um, uh, I don't know if the workshops are still uh, uh, being sold, but uh, check it out on the website. Yeah. Um, yeah. So we went to lots of different spaces, and actually today we were supposed to uh, <laughs> explore the MA space in full. Um, yeah, um, and it was supposed to launch yesterday, but there are some technical difficulties. Um, so sorry about that, everyone. It will get up later today. Uh, and I really wanted to share some with you uh, today, but um, in the space and explore it together with Marie and all of you. Um, I've seen some screenshots. It looks beautiful. The exhibition <laughs> is there, like, and with all the assets and everything, it's, it's super beautiful. Um, and I'm very excited about it. Um, so Marie, if you yes. say the MA space, what would you imagine? Like if we could like explore it in like a yeah, virtual, yeah. In, our, in our minds, like what would you see? Okay, I've seen nothing. Uh, so yes. only last year, 
I've seen also the because what's also a, a bit special from the space is that it was used also for different events. So you, uh, I say you guys, but uh, like the team <laughs> made uh, uh, made different skins already. So I, I was at the CTM festival and I was already very intense, but very cool, uh, uh, different portals everywhere. And um, I think also for play festival, there were also some uh, also some new characters. So we were not flamingos, but we were a little um, uh, red hood, red hood. How do you say it? this little girl in red? <laughs> <laughs> so I uh, yeah, that's kind of a, a nice of the space that you can keep on coming and it keeps on changing. So you just have to be a bit patient for this time, but uh, expect. Um, so I guess we'll still be flamingos. I heard about the flamingos a lot in the last week. So I guess it's, I, I, I don't know the whole design of the, the communication. Are we going to be in mushroom world? It's some kind of nature, digital nature spaces, maybe. That's a good question. OK, there, there will be there will be some nature. Nice. Um, um, also because of the exhibition, um, so there's some beautiful assets uh, that the uh, nominees made for yeah. uh, okay. for their exhibition, uh, and I like that it's like also coming out in a little bit in like 3D um, as a 3D world. So that's yeah. I think it's a beautiful of uh, of having a space like this that you can actually um, you know adjust it to. Uh, to whatever so it's not like a physical space I mean you can just like behind me you cannot see it much but like behind me is the uh, urban spree that I a yeah, photo sure. that I took like a um, couple of years ago at, at the maze uh, since I've been going to a maze um, since 2012 never expected to be the program curator for <laughs> it actually I didn't even introduce myself <laughs> I remember, I realized. Hey. <laughs> yes, I'm sorry, I'm program now. curator for a maze. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I've been working uh, the past uh, uh, year uh, on the, the program for this. Uh, but before I, and last year we did it for the first time, but before I was just a visitor and um, I actually also did like the first, uh, I was the first maze awards jury member as well. Um, First but yeah, one to judge all, all of the, that. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I went to Urban Spree as well, and this is a picture be, behind me. Uh, and we were talking about the MA space that, uh, yeah, you can change it to whatever you want it to be, right? Uh, which is uh, kind of uh, beautiful. Is this something um, actually uh, uh, which uh, you were doing before? I say you as a maze uh, team, that the Urban Spree, was it allowed to to transform certain things, to paint the wall pink, or is this maybe something you can uh, take with you for the future, this freedom of, yeah, changing everything, every event? What I remember is that there was this giant wall, um, yeah, a giant wall that had graffiti on it for a maze. Yeah. So that, uh, I think, yeah, Thorsen is very well, uh, the festival director is very well connected in the Berlin's, Berlin scene. Um, and he got to change, um, yeah, so he, he, he is in, in touch with like artists, music artists, but also graphic design artists. And I think a couple of years ago, yeah, they did like a um, graffiti wall. And then of okay, course the ex so exhibition already. is in the inside Urban Spray uh, in the gallery <clears throat> part. So they could like, uh, they had different means of materials and stuff. So you always will change a little bit what the, uh, what the feeling of the space yeah. is, right? You would yeah. do it also with your own festival. Um, but yeah, um, yeah, but uh, a May space, we're gonna check it out later, I guess, uh, and we can do it with everyone else. Um, yeah. yeah, maybe we just quote another event during your program. If there's someone else doing a program in a May, or we just, I just improvise it. Next time I go, I just tell people, come yeah. with me, we go down. <laughs> As soon as it's ready, I have to say, I'm also, uh, this is what now we have to introduce our croissant. I'm in Paris, so I don't know exactly when I will be able to do this, but um, <laughs> I will try. We just like improvise an exploration at some point this weekend. Yeah, yeah. Not uh, sure not I can, streams, it's like surprise. <laughs> no, but then it doesn't matter. Yes. And it's, it's really about being in the space together. 
And we can chat, right? You can chat, and there's a voice chat I read somewhere. There is, uh, there is voice chat also in the MA space at certain points. Um, oh, you have to be yeah. in certain space areas. Oh, yes. Yeah, it's a certain, it's a, it's a bubble-like thing, so where you can nice. just and then we can all scream. Other. It, everybody can talk at the same time. Yes. All There's right. also, I think, uh, a green uh, screen uh, where people can. Uh, a green screen can, in the can in the beam themselves. Yeah, in the MA space where they can beam themselves in. Okay. It, it's what I heard. Okay. Not sure if that made it into the thing. I have to say, I don't know if I actually don't watch the stream right now. That I put this green T-shirt in the hope that I would get some animation on my T-shirt. So <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's how it works necessarily. <laughs> But also, I have a green screen behind it, so I can move around a little bit. Uh, because I'm actually in uh, in Amsterdam, I was supposed to um, travel to Berlin uh, this week to be with the, with the team and, uh, and and join them in ten years of May celebrity yes. uh, celebrations. I mean, and um, uh, yeah, but you know. I'm in the Netherlands and everything is turning into a red zone right now. So I was like, let's let's stay home. Yeah. Um, so this is actually quite familiar because uh, it's been like this last year too. Yeah, it's uh, but, uh, but also, you know what I actually like about it being a digital maze? Tell us. That I get. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Thank you. I was like making a little pause yes, yes. <laughs> for you. <laughs> Thank you for stepping into that pause. <laughs> uh, is that I can actually invite people from all over the world to yeah. talk. Yeah, um, and uh, be, after our session, uh, we will have uh, Sakina Latif from uh, Malaysia, from uh, Kuala Lumpur, and she will talk about um, uh, their, her game and uh, cabaret and that I came across uh, yeah. on a stream stream festival, I think. Steam, sorry, Steam Festival, and uh, it looks beautiful, and it has all these beautiful um, uh, art in it. Uh, but she's gonna talk about that later, and I'm very excited about it. So, um, and we've got like for the whole through the whole program, I try to also get people from all around the world involved. So yeah. we have some on Saturday, we have people from <clears throat> Jamaica and from Zambia and. Uh, later today, I think we also got people from um, which one do I want to talk about? Like, <laughs> there's, there's so there's so many of them. Is there, is like there the a, other way around? Is there things which are actually difficult uh, for uh, for you to reach, like uh, 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 areas of the world which are actually not yet uh, partners with you or not yet in your program? Uh, I yeah, I guess um, uh, the Middle East. Um, yeah, yeah, I was thinking is, maybe this is underrepresented difficult. at the moment. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, I I hope we can uh, work yeah, on we it. Can reach out to that. Yes. Yeah. Nice. And um, yeah, there there must be more areas. I mean, Asia is also a very big place, and we have mostly South uh, Asia at the moment. Um, yeah. But yeah, um, but it's, uh, yeah, so I like that about uh, being digital, that you can reach out to these uh, people and uh, have them come in on the stream and talk about their communities, but also just also about their work and yeah. what they're up to and show us did you, more did than you already we normally discuss, see. Did you already discuss how you will do this uh, uh, in the coming years when, uh, when we are going to have physical events? <laughs> <laughs> come on. Uh, I think for someone said to be like a, a hybrid. Yeah, um, a hyper hybrid. A hyper hybrid. So, um, and we have the MA space. So we're probably going to have to look at how, like how would that work when we have a physical uh, um, festival to yeah. also do like a digital part of it. Um, yeah, so I actually, I don't know okay, uh, how that's going to work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, we've got a whole year, I guess, to work to work on that and see what the world will bring us, basically, because that's also the next thing, right? The next surprises. The next surprise, yes, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Not crazy. So what uh, I was uh, maybe like short because we don't have a, a lot of time. Um, 
I was trying, I would like to challenge you to what could have, uh, how do you explore a space which is not working? Because in our program, actually, we always go to those spaces after the event. So now we were cheating a little bit going in the middle of the event and uh, bam, it doesn't work. I think it's, it's, it's fair. <laughs> Uh, it could happen any time that we decide to go to a, a place and it's actually not hosted online anymore or it's, it got damaged too much that there's nothing to see or that the, the multiplayer uh, thing doesn't work. So I was, um, how could we, how far can you explore a maze space without going into the maze space? What could we do now? <laughs> Except where did you find, like I said, okay, the screenshot, you had access to screenshot. Is this from your phone? Uh, no. Aha. So it's somewhere online that I could find. Oh, actually, uh, no, it was just, I guess, wait, where is it? I think it was uh, on the Discord. Ah, so I missed it. Space but it might also be in a backstage area. I actually don't know. But I also have a back, but I can't share this. Can you share your screen? No, or is this not, not about not, no, we're not going to share the screen. Ah, um, so you can't even see this. Okay, then it's not uh, the, the most exciting for the public if we can't share <laughs> <laughs> to describe it. So I have another question. Maybe I missed it in the, in the opening yesterday, but I was wondering what's uh, with the flamingo? Where does this come from? That's a better question for, um, I think for the community and for um, Boston. Okay. Because I remember in the first amazes, it wasn't there. Um, it, it <laughs> the first amazes <laughs> didn't have watermelons or... Um, Oh, is watermelon or, also like a, a watermelon is also is also a thing for a maze yes watermelons and um flamingos i think flamingo because it was it's it's a pink bird and if you look up what uh, they are also very community based um and the maze is of course a very community yeah. community based and the, the community is also like uh, making a maze to what maze is basically especially at urban spray or at the festival sites um when you where you meet each other and there will like pop up all these um wonderful strange uh things that people are just excited to share and do um and i think watermelons came from there but i'm not sure and then the flamingo actually i really don't know how that okay. when that happens but it's uh okay. it's beautiful and um it's also a good metaphor, I think. And Thorsten will be able to explain us in very much detail how and what, so we could ask him. As well. Okay, maybe we invite him to the next secret exploration mode, which is not streamed. <laughs> 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 happening somewhere this weekend. Cool, cool. Um, I'm trying to think if I had the other. Now we can't, exactly. So this is time for the contest, but your croissant is really small compared to mine. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I made this for some myself, so it's coffee and croissants, right? Okay. Um, I also have okay. cherries. Oh, that's okay. I had coffee, but the coffee got cold. But I can, okay, I that's can show okay. you. I can show you. Show you my cup. But we're gonna do yeah. like a, a croissant eating contest. Should I give you? Should I give you a head start? Oh my god! Uh, what What's the goal to eat it the fastest we can? My god! How to enjoy a On croissant? croissant? Um, I don't know. You tell me. Like, like, let's ask the chat. Like, is there? Oh, um, there's something happening in the chat. I don't know where. Well, I'm looking actually on the YouTube stream. So the uh, okay. YouTube live stream. <laughs> if you have <laughs> something like, to tell should us, should we? Yeah, sh something about the uh, croissants. Let us know. <laughs> Anything. We've we've got it ready. We've got it ready. Oh, okay. okay. So, okay, we have, so we have we're going to gonna eat. Go. I go and eat it. One, okay. two, three. We, I'm just gonna, yeah. go, I follow go. you. Yep. I will follow you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is not the fastest okay. you can. No, it's not really, not really the pretty. Anyway, okay. um, yes, so, um, 
Thank you, Marie. We're going to um, wrap this up. That was a very much improvised uh, start of a maze, which is actually a kind of also a maze, I think, which is, uh, is wonderful. Thank you for bearing with me, uh, Marie. Also, no thank you, everyone um, watching this and being part of a maze. You are all wonderful. I'm very thankful that we can do this and have you all here with us. Please check out the stream um, and also the schedule on the website. We have so many things in store for you, uh, talks and panels and conversations and music and interactive sessions, cooking shows. Um, Nomi made a beautiful trailer, uh, which has all of that in there. Um, the team is, uh, is working very hard to make all of this possible. So thank you, team. And, I think we have um, to send something to this team. Like, like I can imagine it's a bit stressful right now with all these uh, little technical delays. So I want to, I don't know if people are in the chat, but I think we have to send lots of love and lots of <laughs> patience and calmness to, uh, to all of you guys. So thank you for doing all this. We enjoy anyway in all the many uh, channels we can follow the program. So I hope you're not uh you're also enjoying i hope this and then uh, some some next time i'm happy to explore this all together but i sent you lots of good vibes from paris <laughs> lots of love from paris lots of love yeah. from amsterdam uh, everyone have a wonderful um a maze i'll see you tomorrow again for breakfast and croissant or coffee and croissants with uh, thorsten this time aha um, we're gonna learn about the flamingos <laughs> and uh, yes, have a beautiful maze and uh, see you there. Bye. Bye bye.